4 inch alien camera assembly. Take the camera plate, two right angle pieces and the two M2 by 8 countersunk screws. Make sure the countersunk screws bed down flush. Take a number one Phillips head screwdriver, insert the locating pin and then the screw. Until firm and repeat. Take the camera, two of the O-rings, and two of the M2 by eight cap screws. First, remove anything covering the screws. Carefully remove the rear screws. And leave the camera assembled. Insert the cap screws through the back of the camera plate. and then slip the o-rings over. Pressing them all the way to the plate. Mate this to the back of the camera and assemble with a 1.5 mil Allen driver. Doing them up evenly and then making sure that the O-rings pull flat. There can be no gap between the camera and the camera plate. It takes a bit of force. You can feel it firm as the O-ring starts to squash and then you can feel the two bed together. The camera back plate has tabs that keep the sensor PCB firmly pressed into the camera case. The O-rings ensure that there's pressure between the carbon fiber camera plate and the back plate of the camera to keep the sensor PCB firmly pressed into the case so it doesn't vibrate. The lens will most likely need refocusing when that step is complete. Now take two 2.5 by 5 cap screws two of the side screws that came with the HS1177 and the two ghosts. Place the ghost on the side of the camera and with the 2mm driver put the M2.5 by 5mm screw into the right angle block and do it up till it's almost firm but can still move freely. If this screw is hard to get in it's because there is a gap between the camera and the camera plate. Then take a Phillips and the camera screw and insert that. And again the same until it's almost tight. It doesn't restrict the movement. And then repeat for the other side. So you're left with an assembly that's firmly held together but still moves freely. Now take two more right angle pieces the M2 by 10 screws and the 2mm nylocks. Fit the right angle to the frame with the locating pin and then take an M2 by 10 with 1.5mm driver and fit it to the right angle piece. Watching until the threads first come through the top, just enough to hold the nut, and then fit the M2 lock nut Holding it in place, continue to drive the screw through the threads until you feel it hit the nylock and then hold the nylock with a 4mm spanner while continuing to drive the thread in. Once you feel the thread reach the end of the plastic, stop, hold the screw and individually tighten the nylock. until the whole assembly is tight and the plastic threads have not been stripped. It's important this assembly is tight as it holds the whole camera assembly to the frame. Take the remaining M2.5 by 5 cap screws and attach the camera assembly to the frame. 
repeat both sides and just do them till they just bed down. Now all that's in place, pinch these tight first to center on the camera and then tighten the lower screws making sure not to over tighten these just firm both sides then adjust the camera angle and gently tighten the angle lock screws both sides and again not over tightening and there we have the completed 4-inch Alien camera assembly.